Your number one goal in terms of how a data lake is architected and structured is that someone from your organization who shares your corporate culture but may not necessarily have expertise in, in data per se should still find the structure of your data lake, the, the names and the contents of the data set stored within it to be fairly self-explanatory so that a self-service uh, kind of approach can work. What you want to avoid is something that is such a cluster of undocumented stuff that nobody really feels competent to go near it. You want it to be a place where people can get a certain amount of instant gratification. If they're looking for something, the structure is going to be fairly obvious where they can find it. The name's going to be fairly obvious. And hopefully, hopefully the schema of that data set is pretty well documented so that they can, they can get what they're looking for. The more that happens, the more they will come back and look for the next thing. The more adoption is driven and the more uh, and the greater return on investment that comes from that data lake.